Welcome to the Moved to Meditate podcast. I'm your host, Addie DeHilster. This is a place for vibrant discussions about mindfulness, movement practices, and ways to find more balance and presence in daily life. Here, you'll find resources to help you progress on your path, as well as insightful conversations with mindful movement, yoga, meditation, and Dharma teachers from a range of traditions. On this podcast, we spotlight embodied approaches to mindfulness and the more contemplative aspects of movement practice. Listen in and connect to a community of like-minded practitioners. Hi, everyone. Thanks for checking out this episode of the podcast. Today, I'm offering something a little different. Rather than a talk or an interview, this is a guided meditation. I thought it would be nice to start interspersing some practices like this among all the conversations that we usually have here. Next week, I will be on a meditation retreat, taking a deeper dive into my own practice, but the podcast will return in June with more mindfulness and movement topics, as well as some guest interviews that I'm really excited to share with you this summer. Today's meditation is a beginner-friendly breath meditation or a good refresher on mindfulness of breathing for those of you who have practiced it before. There's a little more description of what we're doing during the meditation itself, so I will keep this intro brief and let you get into the meditation without further ado. Enjoy your practice. Welcome to this mindfulness of breathing meditation. We'll explore a few different ways you can sense the breath And after you've chosen your favorite breath anchor for today, then we'll practice bringing our attention back to the breath when the mind wanders. Let's begin. Take a few moments to adjust your posture, coming into a comfortable seated position or a lying down position where you can easily breathe, where all your joints feel supported, and where there's a balance between alertness and relaxation. And then see if you can bring your attention to your abdomen. Are there any sensations there as you just land your attention at the abdomen? If it helps, you could take a hand and lightly rest it there on the belly for a moment. And you can be curious, is it possible to feel the presence of the breath here? Is there movement? Maybe relaxing the stomach muscles a little bit if if there's a feeling of tightness and just allowing for that little swell as the breath flows in and expands the abdomen. And that sense of the abdominal area, the belly kind of gathering back in as you breathe out. If it helps to take a few fuller breaths to get a feel for that, you can do that. but this isn't really a breathing exercise. So more than anything, we relax into noticing the way the breath is naturally showing up. Let's try another breath anchor. 
So you can bring your attention to the chest and the rib cage, sort of this middle to upper part of the torso. Sometimes it helps to place a hand on the chest, at the heart. Bringing in that curiosity again, is there movement with the breath? Can the breath be sensed in this area? Sometimes a few more deliberate breaths help us to get a feel for the movement that can happen here. Expansion on the inhale, the release on the exhale. And then we relax, we simply allow the breath to be as it is. Sometimes it's deep, sometimes it's more subtle. Okay, another location we might sense the breath is right at the nostrils, where the breath flows in and out of the nose. This might feel a little more subtle for some of us. It's a small area. And for others, it might be the most interesting place to connect with the breathing. You could take your index finger and lightly rest it along your upper lip for a moment just to feel that there is breath flowing in and out of the nostrils. Do you notice that the breath feels a little cooler on the inhale and warmer on the exhale? One more option for working with the breath, being mindful of the breath, is to hear the sound of the breath. If it's hard to sense the feeling of the breath, sometimes we can let our attention rest with the sound of the breath. So take a few moments just to listen for the breath, be curious. No need to make the breath louder or to breathe more heavily. Rather, can you listen a little more closely and hear that quiet whisper of your natural breath? And then now for the remainder of this practice, choose one of these locations or ways of sensing the breath, the sound of the breathing, breath at the nostrils, breath in the chest and ribs, or at the abdomen. Choose one and stick with it for a while. Really let your attention collect with that technique. That place, that method 
of knowing the breath. It might help to use a mental note of in, in, whenever you feel the breath flowing in, and to note out, out, whenever you feel the breath flowing out. We don't need to make the breath happen. We're not telling us to breathe in and out. We're just recognizing what's going on in this present moment. Knowing when we're breathing in and knowing when we're breathing out. Of course, we'll notice thoughts that pop up that get our attention, and that's okay. When we realize we've been in thinking mode, we can relax again, maybe soften the eyes or the shoulders, maybe sigh out a breath, and then refresh your attention with that chosen location and breath anchor. Knowing when you're breathing in, knowing when you're breathing out, as simple as that. Can you allow your heart and mind to enjoy resting in the simplicity of this next breath in all the way through the breath out? Resting our awareness with this breath, just this.
coming back to the present moment through the knowing of the breath as many times as we wander. So that's today's episode. If you enjoyed this conversation, please share it with a friend, subscribe on YouTube, or leave us a review on Apple Podcasts and help others find it that way. To learn more about my work, the Moved to Meditate class library, courses, or teacher trainings, go to movedtomeditate.yoga. This is Addie D. Hilster. Thanks so much for listening.